here. This is rough. another episode of Roughing It Out. Today, the Rough Kids are in the town of Plettenberg Bay on the Garden Route, which is about 500 kilometers from Cape Town. And today, the Rough Kids go bananas here at Monkey Land as they make some primate friends. Last week, the Rough Kids looked to the skies as they took on a bird watching challenge at Birds of Eden. What is that? Bad. Yeah, that's a yeah. macaw. Yeah. You are correct. In the birth watching challenge, we worked very well together because we all were like looking. We weren't like working on one place and we were all like we spread together and then we like found different birds. While the rough rhinos worked well together, it was not all smooth sailing for the crazy cheetahs. We got a little confused with the map. Then they told us, do you, do you know where you are? And we just said no. The crazy cheetahs, the rough rhinos, you all went out looking for these birds, but the winners are the rough rhinos! Yeah! <laughs> So the rough rhinos managed to rake in 10 rough points at Birds of Eden, putting their score on 50, with the crazy cheetahs trailing on 40 points. Whose game will it be today? Teams, over the past few weeks, many of you have done things you've never done before, and some of you have seen animals you've never seen before. And today, we bring you some more firsts here at Monkey Land, a free roaming primate sanctuary. Do any of you know what primates are? Yes. Yes, Ethan, what are they? They are monkeys. Monkeys, yes. Primates are a group of mammals that consists of some of the most intelligent animals, like monkeys, lemurs, apes, and even us humans. Now, Favor is here to tell us more about Monkey Land and the primates which roam around the sanctuary. Thank you, Favor. Thank you, Vue. Thank you, Chanel. Welcome all you Roughing It Out kids and all the kids watching back home. I'd like to welcome you to Monkey Land, which is located in the crags on the Garden Route. Here at Monkey Land, we have up to 10 species of primates that roam freely in our forest, which means they will be walking around the forest pretty much the same as you will be doing. So if you just give them their space, they will make sure to give you your space and they won't come stealing anything from you. But I'm sure you guys will have an absolutely amazing time. I do hope you get to see all 10 of our free roaming species and enjoy the Gibbon singing his morning song for us there in the background. So enjoy and have fun. Now the first stage of your challenge is easy. If you work together as a team, you will need to cross a suspension bridge. Now, the suspension bridge here at Monkey Land is 128 meters long, the longest in Africa. You will only be awarded a time and rough points if all of you cross the bridge together as a team. Once you reach the other side, you'll be given your next location and an envelope. Do not open your envelope. Now, the envelope contains details for your next challenge. Once you have completed the second stage of the challenge, you will be given a location and also a next envelope which will contain details for your next challenge. Do you guys understand? Yes! Are you guys ready to go and see some primates? Yes! Let's go! Hello kids, how are you? Fine. Are you ready to see some monkeys? Yes. Good, welcome to Monkey Land. My name is Tabata. I will be your guide. So I will show you around and hopefully we can see some monkeys. Are you ready? Yes. Awesome, let's go. Ringtail lemur, yes. King Julian. <laughs> it is King Julian, yes. Right now, as you can see, he's catching the sun. Yes. 
Actually, lemurs, all lemurs, they love the sun. So you will always see them in spots where there's sun or on top of the trees. The capuchin monkeys, they're the most intelligent monkeys. They actually are the ones that we use to in Hollywood movies. Because when they're very young, you show him what to do, and they'll remember and they'll do it. So they're very intelligent. They can use rocks to open peanuts, or they will use uh, wood to fight off scorpions and, and spiders. They're really, really smart. But the rough kids are really smart too. Hope they're ready for the challenge, and the crazy cheetahs are up first. Favor, can you please brief us for this challenge? Okay, kids, for this challenge, you have to cross our suspension bridge, which is right behind us here. It's 128 meters long and about 20 meters high at some points, some points higher, some points lower. For this bridge, you have to stay in single file, but close together. We only let four people at a time cross this bridge. If you encounter some of our primates on the bridge, please give them the right of way. Stop just for a moment, let them cross over the bridge, and then continue. So just keep walking and just don't go too fast. Enjoy. Okay, Crazy Cheetahs, I'm going to meet you on the other side of the bridge. So I'm going to go first. And remember, you have to move as a team. No one can be left behind. Are you guys ready? Yes. Okay, wish me luck as I go across. Good luck. <laughs> And it was Chanel leading the way. Don't look down, Chanel. <sighs> okay, so I made it. It's now the crazy cheetah's turn. Crazy cheetah's, are you ready? Yeah. You can come. Next, a rather nervous looking crazy cheetah team started their 128 meter journey across the suspension bridge. By mankelen, dons verskillende mankie am um, apies besoek. En ons moes oor 'n brug geloop het. Ons moet net as 'n span gedoen het. Wat keer kan as 'n breed dit kwy het veld kwy skeerie bekus dit was wobbly. But the crazy cheetahs were doing really well and working as a team. Come on guys, you're almost there. Okay, well done, crazy cheetahs. We're going to make our way down there for your next location. All right, yeah. off you go. <laughs> After the break, we see who are some really smart primates and who's just monkeying around. Before the break, the crazy cheetahs had to cross a daunting suspension bridge, meeting some primates along the way. Well, keer kan as breed, dit kwy, het veld kwy skeerie bekus dit was wobbly. Well done, crazy cheetahs, for crossing the bridge. Here is your next clue, but remember, do not open the envelope yet. Okay, if you guys are ready, follow me to your next location. I'm trying to do it. 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 You guys can open your envelope now that we're at the next location. Inside this envelope, there are eight pictures, seven. The rough kids were given a list of eight primates. They needed to make their way through the forest, identifying and photographing all of the eight primates on the list. Okay, Crazy Cheetahs, here's your camera. And, okay, go take some pictures. And then It felt like I was a photographer and I took pictures of the black and white rough river and the 
Retailed Evil. So the cheetahs are doing really well. They've found two of the eight monkeys already. Let's go see some more. And this is the one that can go between 22 and 30 kilometers per hour in a tree. Oh, that's a beautiful shot, PJ. Well done. And what monkey is that? The gibbon. The gibbon, yes. Good job. Okay, let's move on to another monkey. The monkey learn it the most not to see the different species of what I've never seen. And the, the blue ball of <laughs> That is such a beautiful shot. You're a natural. <laughs> okay. The crazy cheetahs were making steady progress, managing to identify and photograph quite a few of the primates on the list. Okay, guys. We've actually come to the end of our tour. I'm so glad you managed to find some of the primates, even though you only found five out of the eight. That is how it goes here at Monkey Land, because the primates would move around and maybe some of them were behind us wherever we were going. But I am happy that you managed to find some. And you managed to find the gibbon, which Favor was saying that some people come here just to see the gibbon, and then they don't get to see the gibbon. <laughs> exactly, so you were very, very lucky. So while the cheetahs have found five of the eight primates, let's see how the rough rhinos are doing. Okay, Rough Rhinos, remember, this challenge requires that you work together as a team, okay? Yeah. So I will be at the end of the bridge waiting for you guys. But I'll let you favor tell more about this. Thank you. Okay, guys, so the easiest way to get over this bridge is if the four of you stick together and walk in single file. If you're going to start running or go too fast, the bridge will start moving quite badly with you. If you see monkeys on the bridge, slow down. Give the monkeys the right of way. If they want to cross the bridge or come past you, allow them to do that. But don't stand still completely. Just slow down a bit, otherwise the monkeys will think you're wanting to interact with it. So just allow them to go past you and then stay single file, stay nice and calm, and I'm sure you'll all make it. You understand? Yes. yes. Okay, now because only four can go at a time, I will go and I will meet you at the end of the bridge, okay? Come on, Vuyo, it's not that hard. You can do it. And remember, the monkeys have right of way. I've made my way across the bridge. Let's see if the Rough Riders will go bananas doing this, or if they'll keep their sanity and make their way across the bridge. And the Rough Riders were off, with Reef leading the way, looking pretty confident. When we were walking across the bridge on our first activity, um, everyone was acting pretty much scared, but I wasn't really scared at all. Um, we didn't have to do much teamwork because it was just walking across the bridge. You, most people can walk across the bridge. Okay, we just call it a challenge. We just discuss ba. So we call we're still alive. <laughs> okay, so you guys have finished the first stage of your challenge, which was the easy one. And now we get to the nitty gritty of today's challenge. I will give you the first envelope. Remember, you are not to open it until you arrive at your next location, okay? Now, Favour will take us to our next location, okay? Are you guys ready? Yes. Let's go, come on. There we go, guys. Rough Rhinos, you're at your location. You can open your envelope and read your clue. 
So the rough rhinos were also given a list of eight primates found in the forest. They will need to find and photograph them in order to complete this challenge. Pietro has your camera for you. Mandela, are you going to go first? Yeah, she's going to go first. Okay. Always remember, when you have the camera, it has to be hanging around your neck, OK? Pietro will walk ahead of us, but she will not point out any primates to you guys, OK? But you can ask her or me to confirm which primate it is that you're seeing. <coughs> so Pietro is going to go ahead and show the way. And so the photo expedition begins. Uncle Sam, science and challenge, just any way a camera got a similar for the e monkey. This is money leg, it's a paper, it's a listing. A pretty of mana eat black and white name. Then, so it's Chiji Salon. So, some of the monkeys were really hard to spot. So we had to all work as a team and use our eyesight. But then when Zolisa had a turn and he tried to get the picture of the one monkey, I forgot what it's called, then he, the only shots that he got were blurry. So then I took a turn and then I got one of them. I got two pictures and we chose the one. Loads in the forest on the right left as well. Spotting the monkeys, it was, it was quite fun. Uh, I can't exactly remember what monkeys I, I spotted, but um, working the camera was also quite cool and um, our team worked very well together. And back when Dengue sources are one of the rough rhinos, is a Kubanja Nikula challenge. You have to stay on the path. Before the break, the rough rhinos started their photography challenge at Monkey Land. Let's take a look at how far they got. Spotting the monkeys, it was, it was quite fun. Uh, I can't exactly remember what monkeys I uh, spotted, but um, working the camera was also quite cool and um, our team worked very well together. The rough rhinos seemed to enjoy their walk in the forest and were finding lots of the primates too. Okay, guys, you have actually reached the end of your challenge. How many did you get? Five. Congratulations. Well done. So the rough rhinos have completed the second stage of their challenge and they have found five out of eight of their primates off their list. And now let's move on to the next challenge. Okay, team, so this is the last part of today's challenge. Will you and I have your last clue, clue two. So crazy cheaters, here's yours. Okay, you can start reading now. In the final stage, the teams had to select one teammate who was given three minutes to tie the opposing team with a rope. One person from each team would be blindfolded and would need their teammates to guide them. Crazy cheetahs, who are you choosing? Lita. Lita, okay. Our frylos, have you selected a teammate? Okay. Okay, cheetahs, come to the side. Come to the side, cheetahs. Rough Rhinos, guys, all of you, come to the okay. side. Come to the side. going to tie up. And you guys will need to be careful about this, okay? You'll need to be clever so about this. So three people are tying up. Yeah. Yes, you three will be tying up. Okay, Rough Rhinos and Crazy Cheetahs, your challenge starts in three, two, one, go! Go, go, go! Tie these guys up, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. You can move them. You know, when you turn I'm trying to learn about when I get some more pain and then you need to send the show by the guys who can like. Yeah, kind of challenge. Go, 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 at the rope tying challenge, we, uh, we 
chose Riff because he said that he has some experience in um, scout knots, and then we chose him. But um, Zolisa also wanted to have a turn, but then he said he knows how to tie scout knots. Ten seconds to type the cheetahs. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop time. Okay. Lita, gonna blindfold you. Okay. V's gonna blindfold Reef. Rough rhinos, crazy cheetahs, get ready in three, two, one. Go. Come this side, this side, this side, this side, this side. No, 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 no. First on top, first on top. Come up, up, up. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, okay. I open your legs. And within seconds, Lita managed to free her team. Yes, yes, yes. Yay! Well done, crazy cheetahs. Well, guys, I believe it's been a crazy day for the Rough Kids today. Yes, and definitely a day that we'll never forget, right, guys? Yes. <laughs> Favour, thank you once again so much for being an awesome host. You're welcome. But Favour, we have one more favour from you. <laughs> we need you to announce the winner, please. Will do. It was absolutely fantastic having you guys here. I know you got to see some of our amazing primates. And I know you didn't get to see all of them, but I just wanted to remind you that our Sakis and our Hanuman Langers, as well as our Howler Monkeys, which weren't on your list, are very, very hard to see. So I think you all did absolutely amazing. But the team that did push it, the amazingness just a little bit more was the Crazy Cheetahs. When they announced the winners, I was very happy that we won because we lost the last challenge. And Kumba and Gangoba, and though I usually like each other, the Zawin and Sanjay Tentin is our winner, and I'm saying So, in the end, they're a little on the Gangoba Pogo because I hate So, while the crazy cheaters are celebrating their victory here at Monkey Land, let's take a look at the scoreboard. So after an interesting day at Monkey Land, the crazy cheetahs earned themselves 10 rough points. Once again, leveling the scores on 50 points each. Teams, do you realize that today you saw over 500 monkeys, apes, and lemurs? Yo. <laughs> <laughs> That's a whole lot of monkeys and a whole lot of bananas. And these animals are so intelligent. Mm. So, Yusra, what was your favourite part today? My favourite part of the day was when we had to look for the monkeys on the list and take pictures of them because it was quite fun. Ethan, what was your favourite challenge today and then your favourite monkey? My favourite challenge of the day was when we had to cross the bridge because it was wobbly in a little and my favourite monkey is the howler monkey because it is the loudest primate on earth. It's been another rough day and the rough kids have risen to the challenge. Join us next week for some more thrilling adventure and more amazing firsts. Next week, the rough kids travel to Kleinby where they take on the great white shark. <laughs> Dus sien ek hier kom my huif voorby en ek skrik eerste en ek vat sy my voor toe. It's so cold. How are you guys doing this? So join us next week for some thrilling underwater adventures.